hey, it says it costs fifty dollars to get in this club. Can you help? This club right here says it costs seventy five dollars to get into the club. Can you help with that? Is it really one hundred dollars to get into this club for real? Oh my goodness, I was looking at prices for this club. It's a hundred and twenty five dollars to get in. Hey man, there is no way. Is this really right? One hundred and fifty dollars to get into this club? Can you help? Biggest club prices is wild, huh? Don't worry, I'm gonna give y'all some tips on how you can get into Vegas pool parties and nightclubs for free. Let's get started. What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to talk to you all about the club pricing in Vegas for the pool parties and the nightclubs. I'm gonna talk to you all about the difference between general admission, I'm gonna talk about guest lists, and I'm gonna tell you all how you can get into the clubs for free. Now, as you just saw earlier in the beginning of this video, the pricing for these clubs and pool parties in Vegas can be crazy. They can be very, very high, be a car payment to some people's extent. Um, but I'm gonna show you all how to get around that, how you can get into clubs for free. And if there's a particular club that you wanna go to that you just don't wanna pay to get into, um, some alternatives to that. Um, so let's just start with general admission. So as you saw at the very beginning of the video, all of those prices that you saw were the general admission prices were for if you were to buy tickets online or if you were to go to a pool party or nightclub and just get in line, that's what it would cost you to get into the club at the time of those screenshots because pricing goes up every day. And that's one thing about Vegas clubs is you're going to go to the clubs if you don't get on the guest list, which I will break down later on in this video. Um, and you pay general admission if there's somewhere that you want to go that doesn't have guest list open it's best to buy tickets in advance because waiting to the last day to go into a club the price could double depending on where you're going or it could be completely sold out um so that's your general admission just what it costs to get into the club um definitely get those tickets in advance if there's a place you want to go to that doesn't have guest list you can always reach out to me on social media my email is in the description you all need to know if guest list is available or not so my first tip for getting into the clubs for free would be to do party bus tours or club crawls. Now let me quickly break down the difference between the two. Now in essence they're the same thing but the difference with the club crawl is the club crawls normally walk to their destinations because the bars and clubs that you'll go to will be in walking distance from your meetup point. The party bus tours they have the meetup point but at some point they will get on a party bus and the bus will drive you to the destination. I always recommend doing party bus tours because they're more fun. And because you get to be on a party bus and you normally get free drinks on the party buses, the club crawls and the party bus tours, both the initial meetup spot, you'll get a wristband and they'll give you like five dollar drinks or two for one drink specials. Um, but that's the major difference. The club crawls, you're going to basically be walking from each place to the other. And with the party bus tour, you'll go to multiple destinations, but you'll be taken there by way of a party bus. Both of these are great options to get in the clubs for free. Why? Because you're paying to be on the tour not to just go to the club so not only do you pay it could be typically 40 to 50 dollars you can find these tickets for cheap on groupon depending on the tour um, but once you sign up on the tour they will get you to these lounges and to these clubs and they will walk you in for free um, you will have to wait in line but the lines aren't as much of a wait because you're on the tour versus general admission or in guest list in some cases um, but you will not have to pay to get into these clubs so you will as a benefit of being on this tour be able to go to multiple clubs throughout the night for free Tip number two, bottle service. Now I know some people might be like, how are you getting to the club for free if you ban for bottle service? Aren't you paying to get into the club? Technically no, because if you wanted to get into a club, you could pay to get in and you would not get bottle service. There are some people who believe that you actually have to pay to get into the clubs in order to get bottle service, which is absolutely not true. If you book a table for the night or get bottle service, that will cover your entry and that will cover everyone in your group's entry. So let's use Dre's for example. $125 if you wanted to go see two chains that particular night let's say it's a group of four guys if you multiply that by four that's $500 just for you all to get in the club and because Dre's doesn't have guest list right now there's no other way to get into the club other than buying tickets or to get bottle service so depending on how far in advance you book your table you may be able to get a table for a thousand minimum of course tables depend on the location and how far in advance you book there are so many different factors that go into bottle service but that does cover your entry so if you're going to pay all of that just to get into the club then you have to get drinks and then if you meet people you want to spend more on drinks for all the money that you might spend in your group total between getting in and drinks it might just make more sense to get bottle service because not only will you have your own area 
and have your entry covered. You'll have your own bottle and you'll have your own space. And tip number three, the biggest reason for doing this video, guest list. Guest list is the cheapest and easiest way to get into the clubs for free. Now, when it comes to guest list, the difference between guest list and general admission, as I said, guest list people will get in for free. General admission people will be paying those prices that you saw earlier in the video. Now, you hear me talk about guest list a lot in the video for that particular reason, because if you're going to Vegas and you're going to a pool party or a nightclub, if you're on the guest list, you can get in for free. So you don't have to worry about paying those prices. But guest list, the details do change nightly, which is why I say all the time. Reach out to me on social media, send me an email, let me all help you so you don't go to Vegas and get scammed because I have been scammed on guest list multiple times. So how it works is for ladies, it's very simple. Ladies, if guest list is open, it is free. For you. Um, the details of the guest list will change each night. So sometimes guest list may be open till one, sometimes it may be open till midnight. They may cut it the first hour, all depends on where you're going, if there's a major artist performing, but for ladies, guest list will always be free. They will. I've not seen one female pay on guest list to get into any club. For guys, how guest list works. For the most part, it's even ratio for guys. So for every guy in your group, you need a female. So if it's two guys, you need two girls. If it's three guys, you need three girls. If for whatever reason you have three guys, but there's two girls, then two of the guys will be on guest list. The third person will have to pay general admission. There is typically one club or a pool party um, that will have an open guest list so if it's all guys they will accept all guys but those that can change my night and those clubs are very very slim so my advice to all guys is try to have at least the same amount of girls as there are guys if you don't have any girls with you go around the city <laughs> go around to the hotel casino just be on the strip be fun be friendly Hey, I'm on the club. I'm going to the club tonight. I'm on guest list. You and your ladies want to come join us in the club tonight. We can get y'all in for free. 9.9 .9 out of 10 times. That always works. Oh, yeah. We can get into the club for free for sure. Yeah. Just and then let them know that they can join you and your group. Once y'all get in the club, go on about their business. Um, but as far as the requirements and how to get on guest list, it's very simple. Just message me. Let me know you want to get on the guest list. I just need one name from the group. So if you're reaching out to me, I just need your first and last name phone number for confirmation and i'll send all of that information over to get you on the guest list and your name will be on the list for you and your group so you don't have to worry about giving me everybody's name and information just need one name and i'll get that information sent over so hopefully this has been helpful and this will help clarify a lot of information on people who've been asking about guest lists for people who want to know how to get in the clubs for free or for people who didn't even know the full details on how the party bus and club crawl tours work because they are ways to get into the clubs for free and it's a way for you to be able to not only meet different people and hang out with a big group but to club hop as well it's a good way for people who like to club hop so if you all enjoyed this video make sure to hit the like button subscribe if you're new and as always thanks for watching